Hey YouTube, Silver Bear here. Um, I've been pretty busy with uh, a project I've been working on and, you know, going to work and stuff, so I haven't really been around YouTube. I've been checking some videos out when I can and communicating with people uh, uh, by email and whatnot, so. But uh, I'll be back in full swing of things soon. Uh, in the meantime, I'm going to make this, I found time to make this video. I went to a um, antique shop and found this uh, sterling spoon. It has somebody's name in it. Burden. Tried to do research on it. I thought, I wonder what that means. And that's what it turns out to be a name. And so, and uh, the handle is really neat. Totem pole. Give you a good look at that. Right. Someone tested this silver content. That kind of sucks, but at least I know it's real and it does say sterling on it. So, All right. this is a salt spoon. Um, now. Some of you might know this, but uh, I'm really, I'm really fascinated with salt. Um, I read a book called uh, "The History of Salt," and um, oh no, no, I'm sorry, it was called "The Salt: A World History." And um, just when you, after you read a book like that, you you have a good appreciation for salt. So, okay, I also found this at the uh, antique shop. It's a little silver ring. Doesn't fit me. But uh I got it for a pretty good price, so twelve bucks. And it was on uh it was on sale too. Everything in the store was on sale, so Alright. Got a couple th oh wait, one more thing. <laughs> uh I had to show this for anyone in the States that remembers. I'm pretty sure this is exclusively a United States thing, maybe Canada, but uh, Showbiz Pizza. This probably wasn't even all over the United States, but I found this little token for 25 cents, so I had to get it. Okay, anyway, not important. <clears throat> uh, but I did find this. Um, it's a 1939 British uh, shilling. Oh, no, I'm sorry, six pence, and I picked it up for uh, 50 cents, so I thought that was a good, good score. And I got a couple things in the mail from a friend of mine who's a fellow YouTuber. I haven't met him in person, but we do silver trade, or gifting, rather, and I uh, sent these little coins here. This is a, uh, this is a Polish, what is that, um... Grazi, I guess. Ten Grazi. And then this is a uh, an old British sixpence. 1846. That sucker's pretty old. And then another YouTuber that I like to communicate with and we're doing a silver trade asked me to find him a few things. Um, but in the meantime, I found some things of my own. That uh, some of the stuff he was looking wanted me to find uh, here in the states, I didn't have myself, so I, I went and got doubles. But then one of the coins, I kept finding a better deal, and that was uh, this 50 cent commemorative coin here. So I found a better deal, and then I'm looking around and I found another deal, and then an even better deal. <laughs> and then I have uh, his that is put away for the silver trade, but <laughs> so I did get. I finally got an Onza, which uh, he kind of prompted me to get it. I got two of them for a really good price and in really good shape, so I'm happy about that. And then, in the, and also in the search for these commemorative halves, I found uh, this half here. Um, now I know that he wants to collect these. Uh, so, I'm going to try to find more of these two. 
and when I do, I'm going to see if he wants them. But uh, I figured these things were hard to get. These were um, hard to get for a good price. But I'm pretty happy to have these. All right. And I finally got a 20, Netherlands 25 cent 1943 well, with the palm tree privy. I don't know if you can see it. It's right there. Um, got the, I was the only one that bid on this coin. And uh, what did I get it for? Like $1.99. And it was like a dollar ninety nine shipping, <laughs> or something like that. Um, yeah, so I'm pretty happy about that. And I got this little uh, um, what is it again? Twenty Fenning, a German twenty Fenning, in eighteen seventy five. And uh, I didn't pay too much for this, but I don't remember exactly. How much? Okay, and last but not least, my uh, my bid for Brian the Logs auction, and uh, I won it twenty five bucks, and that twenty five dollars went to um, to help his brother and sister in law with their new baby, and uh, I'm happy to have this commemorative. This is the Great Smoky Mountains, which is kind of neat because um, I lived there for about six years. Loved it there. Probably moved back there one day. And it's uh, not a reeded edge, but uh, and it's one of one. So there you go. Yeah, I like this. is cool. <laughs> All right, there you go. Love it. All right, guys. Uh, um, appreciate you watching and uh, try to get get to your videos when I can I haven't been leaving comments because I noticed that um, comments just take even more time <laughs> so I'm sorry but I do I am liking them I am giving a thumbs up though when I, I watch your videos and um, occasional comment when I can but I've been really stressed with uh, on time so okay well thank you thank you everybody bye